Hi guys, I miss you. Um, I thought I'd be brave and try reading you a story today. It's called Pete the Cat, I Love My White Shoes. Do you guys have a cat at home? I have a cat. She's white and her name is Daisy. Pete the Cat was walking down the street in his brand new white shoes. And Pete loved his white shoes so much, he sang this song. I love my white shoes, I love my white shoes, I love my white shoes. He's playing guitar. Oh no! Pete stepped in a large pile of strawberries. What color do you think his shoes were? You're right. They turned red. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He just kept walking and singing his song. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. Oh, no. Pete stepped in a large pile of blueberries. What color did you think his shoes turned? Right again. Blue. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing his song. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. Got an umbrella. It's starting to rain. Uh-oh. Pete stepped in a large puddle of mud. Hmm, what color is mud? So what color did it turn his shoes? Brown. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing the song. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. Ooh, he's drinking something hot. You think it's hot coffee or hot cocoa? It's got steam coming out the top because it's hot. Oh no, Pete stepped in a bucket of water. And all the brown and all the blue and all the bread was washed away, were washed away. What color were his shoes again? Do you remember what color they started out to be? White, but now they were wet. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing his song. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. The moral of Pete's story is, no matter what you step in, keep walking along and singing your song. Because it's all good. The end. Miss you guys. Hope to see you soon.